log 10 square root and cube root transformation and inverse log 10 square root and cube root in graph pad prism log 10 and inverse or anti log 10 in graph pad prism log 10 transformation is one of the method that can be used to attempt to convert data that are not normally distributed to become normally distributed as normal distribution is one of the assumptions or the prerequisite condition to perform parametric tests in statistics and log 10 is one of several uh, methods that can help in converting the data to become normally distributed here in this graph pad prism i had inserted 10 scores and we have a variable here labeled as data one and to perform log 10 transformation click here on the analyze icon in the new window here click on the transform and select the transform uh, option in the new window here click on the or tick on the transform y value using and the menu will have a list in it for several mathematical function and to do log 10 select the y equal to log to bracket y and uh, for the new graph and take this option and then click on ok all the data is transformed based on log 10 to inverse log 10 or to do an anti-log for this data i.e. to revert this data back to original data then we're going to do anti-log and since log 10 is based on 10 then we're going to use the factor 10 to the power of the value for each one of these uh, uh, scores to do that click again on analyze again select the transform and in the window here option click on the transform y value using and search for y equal to 10 to the power of the y and if you click on that and then untick the create a new graph of the result and click on ok the data has been inversed log 10 and reverted back into the original data square root and inverse square root data transformation in graph pad prism to perform square root transformation for data one in graph pad prism click on analyze in the new window select transform click on ok and in the new window tick on transform y values using and search for the function or the command of the square root which is y equal to square root between two bracket y select that function click on ok all the data all the scores or values within data one are square root transformed to inverse square root transformation click on analyze and in this new window select transform click on ok and in the next window again click on transform y value using and search for the uh, function which is y equal to y squared select that function click on ok the data is uh, uh, reverted back into the original 
and an inverse square root transformation of the data is performed. Cube root transformation and inverse cube root in graph pad prism. To perform cube root transformation for data one in graph pad prism, click on the icon for analyze. In the new window, click on transform and then click on OK. And in the next window here, click on the transform Y value using. And if we search here for the cube root is not present. And to insert manually the equation for the cube root, Click on the user defined Y function as with this function, you could insert any equation to be uh, used for transformation. So click on add and in the new window, give the function a name. We call it cube root. And then for the equation type Y to the power to bracket one over three. This is the equation for the cube root. Click on OK and then click on OK. The data are cube root transformed in graph pad prism. Now to do the anti uh, cube root or inverse of the cube root transformation, again, click on analyze, click on transform, click on OK. And in this window, tick on transform Y values using and search for the Y equal to Y to the power of K. And for the K, insert figure number three and then click on OK. The data are inverse cube rooted in graph pad prism.